Hey, everybody, and welcome back or welcome to Danica Marie and our dope discussions. Today is going to be one of those quick, short, easy, dope discussions for our brothers out there that may need some help as far as picking up on some signs that a woman likes you and how you can act on it. Okay. So today we have three signs that we're going to be touching on. Um, that a woman likes you and how you guys can act on it, okay? Now, the first one should be something that's a no-brainer, but some men may get confused by this because they don't know if a woman is just trying to be, I don't know, more platonic or friendly or whatever the case is, but I'm letting you guys know right now, as a woman, if a woman invites you out alone, yeah, she likes you. Um, a woman does not invite a man out alone unless she feels comfortable with him, unless she feels like she can trust him and she wants to be vulnerable with him and exclusive with him. Um, so if she invites you out maybe for dinner at her place or if she invites you out to lunch somewhere, again, this is not like a social gathering to where it's going to be a whole bunch of different people there. It's just you and her. That means that she really likes you and she wants to get to know you on a more exclusive, private level. Um, and in most cases, um, a, ro a romantic level as well. So uh, you guys, if you find that a woman is inviting you out to places to where it's just going to be you two one-on-one, -on -one, that's a high sign that uh she really likes you and she wants to get you get to know you better so do not sleep on uh, a woman asking you out or inviting you out along especially if it's somewhere um that she frequents or somewhere that she really likes because that means that she does not mind inviting you in to i don't know more of her personal space you know, she's trying to share with you something that is special to her, which means that she finds you to be very special as well. Okay. So if she invites you out alone, fellas, she likes you and do not sleep on that sign. And how you can act on this is simply just taking her up on the offer. Um, a lot of guys can be, I don't know, a little shy when it comes to a woman inviting them out and things of that sort, but you guys have got to get in the habit of not being shy or afraid or, you know, second guessing yourself or feeling like, you know, you're going to fumble or something's not going to go right. Like, just go ahead, take her up on the offer and see what it's about, you know, um, and embrace it. You know, do not start to, again, feel like, oh, uh, should I do it? Should I go? Maybe she doesn't like me like that. Maybe she's just being nice. No, go out there, go on a date with her or wherever she's trying to invite you to and enjoy the moment. Don't overthink it. Act on it. Okay. There, there's nothing else that you can do, but go out there, act on it, take her up on the offer and have a good ass time. Okay. 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 You guys. So the next thing that we have as far as, you know, three signs that she likes you and how you can uh, act on it is she tells you private things. Okay. Now this is major fellas. Let me tell you as a woman. Okay. So many of us as women, we like to be guarded and we only want to tell or show the world the most upstanding, if you will, things about ourselves. We want to make it seem like we're damn near perfect, right? So if you find that a woman is being more open with you and discussing things with you that may be, you know, something that's a little more of a private matter, that's a huge sign that she really likes you. And again, this ties back into that whole trust element, you know, because we... We don't like to share too much as women, especially when we are trying to, I don't know, make a good impression on a man. We don't want to expose too much about ourselves, especially like personal matters. So if you find yourself dealing with a woman 
to where um, she's being more open with you and she's telling you things that not everybody knows. Oh, really, really take heed to that sign. And um, I would also go ahead and tell you guys to just reassure her that it's okay for her to confide in you and it's okay for her to continue to talk to you and things of that sort just to really get her more open and more comfortable and you never know that is how the most healthy and strong relationships can blossom you know by somebody being able to tell you even the most deepest darkest secrets or just things that they wouldn't otherwise share with somebody that you know they did not care about or trust so how you can act on this is just simply uh again reassuring her that hey whatever your secrets are or whatever the things that you feel maybe ashamed about or embarrassed about or you know whatever the case is it, it's safe for you to share those things with me and just you know help her to become even more vulnerable and open because that's something that as women we really love to do with men we really would like to do with men i should say you know and unfortunately it's not a lot of um uh, men we may trust in that in that uh manner you know because so many people today want to use things over your head or try to blackmail you or you know expose you or whatever the case is so if she's ready and willing to go ahead and tell you some of the most private things about herself again she trusts you she really likes you and most times also she sees a future with you because otherwise i would have just held this to myself i would have kept this to myself i would never shared it with you so the the fact alone that she's sharing with you means that she trusts you to also you know keep her secrets and you know just make sure that you guys are forming you know a, a very trustworthy relationship um you can also if you feel comfortable enough you can also maybe start to share certain things about yourself and again you guys never know it could form into something that's beautiful you know as far as a healthy strong foundation of a relationship because you guys are letting each other in on things that not a lot of people know about so just again reassure her that it's okay and maybe even start to expose little things about you slowly and surely just to make sure that you know she also knows that you i don't know maybe trust her a little bit you know and i get it you guys oh uh, we do live in a day and age to where you really do have to be very careful about the things that you do share so i'm not going to tell you guys to just go all out and start telling this woman you know your deepest darkest most intimate secrets about yourself but just give her something to where she knows like oh, okay you know it's okay for me to continue to express myself as far as you know maybe some of the most vulnerable things about me because he is telling me something that maybe not a lot of people know about right so just give a little you know not too much but just give a little to let her know that hey it's all good sis you can continue to confide in me and tell me you know whatever is bothering tell me whatever is on your mind at that time okay and again you guys this can lead to something beautiful all right you guys so we do have one more thing on our list that i want to tell you guys about but hold on you guys this is something that i feel will really help for women to start to like you personally okay so before we get into the last thing on our list i have got to share with you guys one of the best skin care products and items out there for men just like you and that is none other than teach hanley you guys women love men that keep their skin clear and soft and glowing and vibrant you know just like you guys love a woman that does the same thing for herself right so before we move on to the next thing on our list i want to share with you guys teach hanley's great product for men 
And this is absolutely something that will help women to gravitate towards you. And you never know, maybe she just might like you a little bit more. Stay tuned. Okay, crown heads. You already know I'm super excited about today's sponsor. You guys have absolutely heard me talk about them before, and I'm pretty sure you're going to keep hearing me talk about them because I know the positive impact their products will have on your life, okay? And that sponsor for today is none other than Teach Hanley, okay? Seriously, crown heads. I still don't think some of you believe me when I tell you how much implementing a quality skincare routine will improve your confidence in every aspect of your life. Teach Hanley makes taking care of your skin uncomplicated. They provide you with all the products you need and nothing that you don't. I recommend you guys start with their level one system, which comes with all of the basics. A daily face wash, an exfoliating scrub, a morning moisturizer with the SPF 20, and a nighttime moisturizer. Oh, and to make it super easy, crown heads, Tej Hanley will provide you with an instruction card in every box that tells you when to use each product, how much to use, and in what order to use it in. It definitely comes in clutch. But you don't have to take my word for it because they have over 5,000 five-star reviews from customers from all over the globe. This isn't something you want to put on because prevention is key. Get ahead of any signs of aging now. Your future self will thank you. Now, in addition to amazing skin, members of Teach Hanley get tons of benefits, including at least 20% off the retail price, access to exclusive monthly deals, and you can pause and cancel at any time. And you guys, it's free US shipping. And because Teach Hanley is sponsoring today's video, they're offering my crown heads a great deal. Just click the first link in the description and you'll get 30% off your first box plus a free gift. Like seriously, that's an amazing deal. Click that link below and get started today. You guys, this Teach Hanley, it smells so fresh, you know? And it's not like this overwhelming or overpowering smell. I really love it. Um, and as you guys could see in that quick little uh, video that we just had there, my friend Leo actually used it. He used this product, the Teach Hanley, and he loved it. And when I felt his skin, his, his skin felt smooth. Uh, he looked like he had a new glow to him. Like this product, you guys, <laughs> it seems to be working. And I even gave him a box for him to use and he has had nothing but great reviews for it. So um, we do have a link down below for you guys uh, to go ahead and purchase your T. Chanley today. And they do have a discount for you guys. So head on down to that link below and purchase. This can absolutely uh, help you guys to feel more vibrant and sexy and good and confident about yourself. Because again, this is something else that uh, women do like. So head on down below and get your box of T. Chanley today. Okay, you guys. So we have one more thing on our list as far as the three signs that she likes you and how you can act on it. And this right here, fellas, she initiates interactions with you. Now, with this one right here, this means that you are hitting it out of the park. This means that this woman really, really likes you. Because let me let me be honest with you guys. You guys already know that the majority of us women are taught 
that the man is supposed to uh, approach you. The, the man is supposed to go after you. The man is supposed to chase you, right? So if a woman is going out of her way to say, screw that, I like him, I want to talk to him, I want to interact with him, I want to engage, yeah, she really likes you because she is going against what a lot of us women are taught to do, right? We're taught that we are the prize and um, the the man is supposed to initiate and he's the, the one that is supposed to try to show and prove himself to us, right? So if a woman is constantly stopping you, maybe let's say at work and she always wants to have a conversation or a woman is always coming up to you and uh, again, inviting you out or just wanting to do things with you. It doesn't matter what it is. If she's doing that, she really does like you because it goes against everything that a woman is taught to do and be when she is initiating, right? So do not sleep on when a woman is initiating conversations, interactions, or just flat out flirting with you. If she goes out of her way to, you know, flirt with you first, that's a huge indicator that she really likes you. And how you can act on this? <laughs> Hello, just talk to her back if you like her. Now, if you don't like her, right, then I would just keep it short and sweet and just kind of be like very quick and short with your words or just the whole exchange and make sure that it's dry. But if you do like her, continue to talk, you know, ask her questions, dialogue with her, maybe flirt back, uh, flirt back with her, whatever you feel is necessary to make sure that the interaction is continuing to go smoothly. Um, but these are very, very strong indicators that a woman really likes you guys. You guys let me know how you feel about this quick, dope discussion. And again, do not forget to head on down to that link below and get your teach handle, you guys. You won't regret it, all right? So again, you guys, I love y'all. I respect y'all. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this quick, dope discussion. And tell me, what are some of the signs that you pick up on to let you know personally that a woman really likes you, all right? And what do you do when you are picking up on those clues and hints, all right? But I love y'all. I'll see y'all later. Danica Marie, we are out. Much love and peace.